Hey guys, Amanda here, and in this video, I am going to be reacting to RuPaul's Drag Race All-Stars Season 5, Episode 7. I'm really excited for this episode. My voice is a little hoarse. Let's have some tea. I am nervous about who goes home. There's only one person left that I want to go home, which is Blair, because Miss Cracker, Jujubee, and... Shea Coulee are my top three. Maybe Blair St. Clair will do so much better than everybody else and I'll want someone different to go home besides Blair. So let's just see what happens. Previously on All Stars. Oh, Roxy. Roxy was so good. You are a winner, baby. What decision did you make? Oh. I, I really wanted to avoid an awkward moment. <laughs> But I thought long and hard about my decision, and the lipstick that I chose was Alexis. Trying to make it dramatic. I'm face so hard right now because you really made me think why like you chose me. Oh, oh, oh. I know, I was really like, I was like, this is an awkward moment. <laughs> I want to see what's inside the box. Do you want me to? Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Hit it. Oh, yeah. What's in the box? <laughs> Let's have a look. Juju me. Alexis. She makes me laugh. And Blair. Which is most likely from Alexis. Yeah. Yeah. This is a little bit of self-preservation too. I feel like there is still so much. We are the top four. We are the top four. I feel like there's big goggles on me to win this next challenge. Because I need that to get the finale. Don't nobody throw no pearls out there on the stage. <laughs> no, I'm I was like, ass? Sickening, no? Ooh, girl. She not ready to have her. She's got to put her money where her funny is. Oh. And I'm not joking, bitch. <laughs> where are the jokes? Where are the jokes? <laughs> Wow. And then there were four. Come on, soup. Wow. A mystery funny lady. <sighs> At RuPaul's Shady Shack. Ooh. It's right off Route 5. <laughs> Route 5. <laughs> now, Miss Crocker, uh, you were the top all star last week, so you get to choose the order in which the queens appear. Oh. This is the challenge that determines who makes it to the grand finale of All Stars. <sighs> Which is no laughing matter. <laughs> or is it? I feel very attacked. <laughs> <laughs> Your girl is not the most confident about doing stand up. I mean, Juju is. Blair has been cracking the judges up all season. Really? But for me, I miss that. Watch, this is definitely going to be a challenge. <laughs> Anybody coming up with any fun jokes? <laughs> Who's there? Who's there? Nobody. Nobody, Nobody who? who? Nobody, because I'm so lonely. Oh, wow. Ladies and gentlemen, Jujubee. Nobody's getting a good spot. Oh. Girl, I could pretend everyone can shine no matter where they are in the show. Oh. But as your sister, I want to try to pick you guys up as much as possible. I understand. So, I great. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Miss <laughs> Cracker. <laughs> Oof. She. Blair, you've been extremely funny this season. She has? This me off. <laughs> In people's minds, they'll be like, oh, am I just remembering her because she was the last one? And they may discount and discredit what you accomplished. Gorgeous. I actually see true colors coming out now. You know what I like? I like that Miss Cracker is just saying it like it is. You know what? I'm going to put you here because this. Put you there because that. You're there because that. I'm going to go here because this and this and that. So I appreciate her telling them why they are in the spots that they're at. She's keeping it real. No tea, no shade. Her eyes? Where do I buy eyes like that? Because I want to <laughs> I'm opening. They're not going to get compared to anybody else's. Mm. And I think that's a great advantage. Okay. That's true. It's really good to hear. You helped me out, sister. What's the plan? <laughs> like I'm the monster in the corner of the room. <laughs> <laughs> what? I didn't get that. From the STDs that I gave that I gave you. I wouldn't open with the STDs. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let us 
influence on me else. I'm also really broke and I love scavenger hunts. <laughs> <laughs> they weren't fully realized. Mm. Make us laugh tomorrow. I will make you cry. Make mm. us laugh. <laughs> <laughs> And you're gonna get the audience to laugh right away, and that is crucial because then they, they trust you. Right. Mm. Great beginning. Okay. Who is Ross Matthews? Uh -huh. Careful. <laughs> no, All right, Blair, I'm excited to see you. <laughs> is anybody who feels like there is no such thing as two? I'm gonna stop you right there, though. It's been mm. a bit since we've had a joke. She's got to get out of her own way and mm -hmm. just be funny. Mm -hmm. The only thing between you and winning this week is going to be you. Okay. Yep. Okay. Bye, Cracker. Bye. Oh, they're all so sweet. The way if you bomb, the entire world's going to see it. Right, yeah. right. I have a lot of nerves, Miss Coulee, if you're nasty. I'm an Aquarius. My favorite color is fluorescent beige. I'm fond of toy poodles, and I love long, romantic walks to the bank. <laughs> that was a nice effort. I liked it. Are these mine? Are they? Oh, yeah, they're mine. <laughs> Tums and ginger ale. Oh. I'm so nervous. I was not able to come up with any material until this morning. Oh, until that morning. Oh, wow. I might as well look drop dead gorgeous. Yes, girl. So your rehearsal? Bitch. <laughs> I kind of, I'm so thrilled to be going last. No, you're not. Truly, honestly, I couldn't. Thank you enough. Like, honestly? No. <laughs> I think all I keep telling myself is I can do this. I have to do this. There you go. My favorite punchline, Michelle the jokes. <laughs> what do you get when you cross an elephant with a rhino? I don't know. Elephino. <laughs> <laughs> so how many drag queens does it take to screw in a light bulb? Two actually. Uh, one to screw it in, another one to say, hey, you're my life, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> that would be me. I'm allergic to wig dander. <laughs> well, you in trouble, girl. <laughs> Why did the blonde drag queen cross the road? Because she's a whore. <laughs> <laughs> Button. Beverages provided by Mickey's West Hollywood. Okay, Mickey. And here's Jujube. I see some new old faces. <laughs> People who bought this book also searched for Chardonnay, lip gloss, a life. <laughs> that the lady who could convince millions of women out there to stick stones in their pussy still not be able to convince them to buy your book. <laughs> <laughs> But she's sitting over there. <laughs> I think of you like I think of my mom. Resentfully. <laughs> that was pretty good. That was pretty good. And I do ass with the crust cut off. <laughs> now, speaking of crusty assholes, Sam Richardson is here tonight, everyone. <laughs> That's all. How you keep escaping from the old folks' home? Uh, uh, oh, I do declare this is a dumpster fire. <laughs> if you love me tonight, my name is Blair St. Clair, and if you hated me, it's Derek Barry. <laughs> Entire set to take a nap. <laughs> Come on. 
She failed her driver's test. <laughs> it only becomes animated when you put your fist in it. <laughs> yeah. I thought that therapy was just for white people with money. And I was wrong. It is also for black people with money. <laughs> have been following me around for the past three years like I'm James Earl Jones and coming to America. <laughs> the only difference, he had a crown. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. First up, oh. Dude, the jester. I barely know her. <laughs> uh, dude, Claire. Claire, oh. Claire. You guys, she's spotting. <laughs> Ms. Oh. oh. Is there a reveal? <laughs> Ooh, yes, reveal. Is this very sexy woman. Shay Coole. Oh. Joseph and the amazing Technico Dream Coat, the gay years. <laughs> <laughs> After that challenge, Blair needs to go home. The other three were just way above her. I'm not sure who I want to win because they were all so good besides Blair. There were some parts of Jujubees that were like, eh, but then by the time she got halfway through, she was killing it. Probably be either Miss Cracker or Shay. That th that's my guess. So we'll see. It's time for the judges' critiques. I know the Starting with Juju B. Hi, Mama. This is just phenomenal. Yes, a sandwich stole my voice. <laughs> <laughs> I'm right here. Her name's oh. Michelle. Oh, 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 oh. I think it took the audience a, 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 a bit to get on board with that. Mm -hmm. If you had one. <laughs> insults which are manipulative in the best way <laughs> oh my goodness see you're working it right there <laughs> <laughs> i sort of pictured myself living happily with you me and ross as a couple <laughs> 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 Yeah. It's just not elevated like the other girls. Yeah, I agree. Let's talk. That red dress was like, what? Oh my right? God. Right? It was like, mwah. I'd love to borrow it sometime. So good. I've made some decisions. Mm, I want to say Miss Cracker. Miss Cracker. <laughs> Congratulations. You're the top all star of the week. You've won an amazing eight night Where? South African safari <gasps> and wine country adventure. Oh, courtesy of South African tourism. I want to go! Take me! Blair better go home. I know Miss Cracker. She's your sister from season 10. But please just send her home. Please, please, please. I want my top three in the top three. That is my dream. You made it. <laughs> Hands down, you deserve to win. Look at this hand. What, these peasant fingers? Oh my goodness. <laughs> I don't think it's necessarily fair to just go on wins. I don't, I don't either. And I think it all stars someone that doesn't necessarily have to win every challenge. Doesn't necessarily have to no. be the top. And I feel like in this competition, we've all grown. But I feel like I've had like this immense growth. You did. You had a nice little growth. Now go home. It is Blair's turn to go. Yeah. She was the weakest this week. Mm -hmm. I'm just hoping that we're all kind of on the same page because if not, who knows how this could go? Vivacious. <laughs> I painted these tears on for a reason, guys. <laughs> Are you still gonna make us vote? Because this is hard. You still gotta vote, honey. Don't forget your poopery. <laughs> Think of you as a sister. That was a good choice. Weary is the neck that turns the head that wears the crown, girl. So, I know what I have to do. That quote's very advanced for me. Are you ready to meet your lip sync opponent? I am. The time oh, has come who could be? to present this week's lip sync ass. <laughs> assassin. Oh. 
No, that's not Latrice. Sorry guys, my light just went out. Hopefully it'll stay on. There's only a little bit left of the show left, so... Hi, yes, Kennedy Davenport! Kennedy Davenport. Newer, LaGuardia, Kennedy Davenport. <laughs> Good to be back. Kennedy Davenport holds the lipstick of the queen that the group has voted to go home. If Kennedy wins the lip sync, El Chapo. I guess I'll give it to Miss Cracker. Miss Cracker, you're a winner, baby. You've earned a cash tip of twenty thousand dollars. Get your money from last week, honey. Back to the castle. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, girl. Oh, I'm nervous. What is she gonna do? Miss Cracker, with great power comes great responsibility. It is a close call. No, it's not. The lipstick I chose belongs to Blair. Okay. <gasps> it is written and it shall be done. Blair St. Clair, you are and will always be an all-star. You will be, honey. I fell in love with myself all over again during this. Aww. Learned to trust myself and to believe in myself. Good. Blair St. Clair that I am is pretty damn good. And I love her. Aww. Audrey Declare, I am the Blair St. Clair. <laughs> <laughs> My top three girls. Congratulations. Next week at the All-Star Grand Finale, let your voice be heard. I'm and team all, all of them. Amen. Amen. The other two were like, uh, what? Uh, uh, uh. I'm scared uh, for next week. What is gonna happen? I generally love a good three song, and this Ooh. is the top three that I anticipate. Me too. I've done this before, twice. Not well enough. <laughs> oh, they're back. I love this, by the way. <laughs> Derek. Juju, how you feeling? so happy that my top three are the top three. Miss Cracker on her season, she was my favorite, but she was all in her head. I was happy to see her. I was like, oh, I want, I want Miss Cracker in the final. Jay Coley in her season, she won the most challenges. I don't know if she was ever in the bottom the finale. I was like, ooh, maybe it's gonna be Shay. I don't know. And then, you know, as we all know, Sasha Fleur came with the rose petals and then she didn't win. Fair enough. Sasha Fleur deserved that win. Jujube is just somebody who's been around the drag race community for 10 plus years. She's just so funny and she she's the comedic drive of the of the season. Like if she wasn't on the season, the show would not be that interesting or that entertaining. And she's talented, obviously. So, I am just so happy with this top 3. I don't know who I want to win because this is my top 3. They're, oh, they all have their strengths and they're all just so good. So we'll see. I think next week we'll, 
will tell me who I want. I can't wait for next week. I will try to post the finale's reaction next week right after it airs Saturday by Saturday night, hopefully. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a fabulous day, a fabulous week, a fabulous month, a fabulous year, and a fabulous life. Bye!